In the name of Allah, today I am going to discuss a very important case of endometriosis. First of all, what is endometriosis? Endometriosis is the presence of functioning endometrial tissue outside uterus. Endometriosis most commonly occurs in the ovary, fallopian tube, broad ligament, and posterior cul de sac. But it can occur almost anywhere in the body, including the bladder and the ball. Endometriosis may be diffuse or localized. and diffuse forum endometrial implants involve the pelvic viscera and their ligamentous attachment the diffuse forum is rarely diagnosed on sonography as implants are too small these undergo monthly bleeding resulting in local inflammatory reaction and adhesions. The localized form consists of discrete mass referred to as endometrioma or chocolate cyst. On sonography, a well-defined cystic mass with diffuse internal grainy echoes is seen. It is to be differentiated from a hemorrhagic cyst, which decreases in size over the next menstrual cycle, whereas endometrioma gets enlarged. This is the case of a 20 year female patient complaining of dysmenorrhea in right pelvic pain. In right side, you can see a round shape, homogeneous cystic lesion with internal echoes presenting as ground glass appearance with posterior acoustic enhancement a differentiated from a solid lesion because a solid lesion does not cause any posterior acoustic enhancement the right ovary is not separately visualized If we want to differentiate it from a cyst, simple cyst, so we are going to decrease the gain. If it was a simple cyst, it will present as, a, as an unequic structure, but it is still hypoequic with internal echoes in it due to dense echogenic material. So it is a typical chocolate cyst if we apply a color so there is no color flow within the cyst it also differentiated from a solid lesion if it was a solid lesion, there would be somehow color flow in it. So there is no vascularity within the cyst. We are going to measure it. It is 3.5 and 3.6. It is quite round chocolate cyst. <laughs> 